Dallas Mavericks was all about Luka Doncic on the night, filling the start for the Mavs to level the series against the Los Angeles Clippers. And that game ended 127 and 114 in yeah. the NBA playoffs. Wow, what a game. What a game that was. Uh, Dallas uh, rebounding nicely after losing the first game to the Clippers. And that's where we're starting from. Uh, the NBA players, it's hotting up already. Two games have gone down already. Some teams will play their third games by today. Some will play their second game as well, too. Talking about the Lakers, we'll come to that later on. But let's give you a rundown of all the matches that were played last night in the NBA playoffs. Of course, it's being played in the bubble at Disney. Starting off with the Mavericks uh, defeating the LA Clippers 127 to 114. That series is now tied to a piece. Wow. Uh, we'll come back to that game uh, in a bit uh, for more comprehensive analysis. Elsewhere, it was the Sun Sixers losing against the Celtics 101 to 128. That means the Celtics now have yeah. a 2 0 series yeah. lead. Jason Tatum, Led once away. again, was the star of the show. 33 points on the night as uh, Cecilia for this young star. Let's Joel, move. Okay. Okay. Yeah. Now, just like Joel Embiid, of course, 34 points, 10 rebounds were just not enough. Yeah. They were actually under pressure yeah. to win this game so that they won't face another early exit Exits. from yeah. the first round. Too bad, too bad. Mm -hmm. But it's not yet over uh, for the 76 star. Uh, they still got two more games to yeah. salvage the situation. Elsewhere was the Utah Jazz as well to leveling their series against the um, Denver Nuggets 124 to 105. That's how that match ended in game two. It was Donovan Mitchell once again coming to the party, scoring yeah. 21 of his <laughs> 30 around. points <laughs> in a big third quarter. Cecilia, um, <laughs> very happy for Michelle. Of course, mm -hmm. his performance is on the back of scoring 57, 57 points yeah. in the opening game loss against uh, Utah. This time around, he's managed uh, to find himself uh, on the winning yeah. side. And his teammate Jordan Classic finished with another playoff best 26 points. Fantastic. Or everyone just rallying together to yeah. ensure they take the game. So it's yeah. one apiece one also. Apiece. I like that. Mm -hmm. I like that. Last but not the least is yeah. this one. The Raptors defending champions mm -hmm. taking on the Brooklyn Nets ended 104 to 99 in this game. It was, the, close. Yeah, it was a very close game. Brooklyn led uh, for long periods, uh, as a matter of fact, uh, for three quarters, more than three quarters. Yeah. Uh, but champions do what champions do. They had to do. Incredible mentality. They Everyone rallied, coming to the party. Never gave up mm -hmm. and eventually secured that victory for 2 0 series lead. Fred Van Vliet, of course, 24.10 assists on the nine. Norman Powell as well. Off the bench, 24 Kyle points. Lowry, 21 Kyle Lowry, 21-9. Kyle Lowry, 21-9. Fantastic. Manga, so of course, was Leader. scoreless yeah. for 17 minutes it, it, on it court. It didn't matter, though. He also had three turnovers. Okay, let's talk, about the, let's talk about the game of the night. Let's talk about the big game of the night. Um, the yeah. Mavericks uh, and the Clippers. Apart from the Lakers and the Blazers, this is another another three tricky uh, yeah. you know, matchup uh, because uh, of the talent uh, in that Dallas side. And once again, look at Don Cheech. Uh, came to the party, 28 points, 8 rebounds, and 7 assists uh, for Dallas in that game 2 victory. Don't you play for just uh, 9 minutes yeah. in the second half because of foul mm. trouble, but that did not really matter At because all. all the other guys stepped up. Did not miss a beat. Thanking, um, starting from Kristaps, uh, pausing his 23 points and 7 rebounds. Tim Hardaway Jr., yeah. 17 points on the night. As well, Trey Buck finished with 16 points while Seth Curry, Curry. chipped in 15. 15 to points. see everyone contributing yeah. uh, to that victory, especially when uh, their star guy couldn't was play out of the game because of foul trouble. That's, that's how that's that's it for you. That's what I was trying to say yesterday. About Lakers, yeah, all these other guys <laughs> have to come to, to what, step up. All they the have time. to step up because anyone can be in foul trouble anytime. Anyone can have a half uh, shooting night. Uh, when that happens, then every other guy has to, to contribute up. something. And if you check and this game, he didn't even need the 47, uh, 42 points he scored in the they, one they, they lost there you because go. others didn't come there to the party. Go. But without him, they knew that they, they needed to they win needed this to one. That, because right. once Clippers pulled this one off, Mm. Then it will be hard for them to come back. Yeah. yeah, so they needed to win this one. Right. And let's shout, talk about shout the out to Kawhi first. Let's of course, Kawhi yeah, Kawhi. yeah, it gives some main, but yeah. just a 35 points, 10 <laughs> rebounds, but then it just wasn't enough. Right. Lou Williams also contributed 23. Mm. Paul George, where he was limited by foul trouble, he had 14 points and 10 
but maybe if nah, not for the foul not trouble. good enough. <laughs> no, that's not an excuse for Paul Judge. Paul Judge in the playoffs has a way of yeah. uh, underwhelming. He never seems to show up. Mm -hmm. uh, okay, I understand. Yeah. Granted, he had foul trouble yeah. and all of that. Uh, but in this game as well, too, it was very, very poor uh, offensively. Yeah, he, he was. Yeah. He shot terribly uh, on the night uh, for... Uh, the Clippers, 14 points, 4 of 17. Come on. That's poor. What has that got to do with foul trouble? Okay. You know? All right. So, relax. Paul but George then, needs to step up in the next game if he doesn't want this series to get out of hand. And Patrick Be Beverly, Beverly, he missed the contest. I mean, strained yeah. ankle. So, just maybe when they have him back. Yeah, perhaps. Perhaps. Yeah. yeah. He's, a very, okay. he's, a, he's a very, very important uh, <laughs> you know, uh, part of that Clippers uh, set up another That's win uh, on the night uh, was on uh, the Toronto Raptors. Yes, of course. Of course. 2 0 for the uh, defending champions. They're looking very good uh, against the Brooklyn Nets. And the coach, Nick Noss, has been speaking, especially on the performance of their all star, Bama Debaye. Seems to be very satisfied with everything he has done this season. Now, for, for the Raptors, I mean, if you, if you look at, at what they had to put together, okay, let's just listen to uh, the coach now talking about, uh, you know, the game, uh, the win over uh, Nets. Because it was a difficult game for them to win, but then they had to rally around. So it was not as easy as the first game where, you know, they had to lead all through more like a blot. But this one, they had to come from behind, especially in the last seven minutes. They had to, you know, really dig deep to be able to win this mm. game.